so I saw Black Adam. I loved it. If you love The Rock, Dwayne Johnson, if you love action, you love, if you just love Dwayne Johnson, if you love action, it was a great movie. It was like full of action, explosions, everything. If you're looking for dialogue, this isn't the movie for you. It's not a movie heavy on dialogue. It's action kick ass. It's good. If you love superhero movies, you'll love this. The Rock. It all starts with like a long time ago, but it was kind of confusing. Like, was The Rock playing like Middle Eastern or something? Because that was like the impression I got. Because um, uh, I know that one guy in the movie, he always plays uh, Pakistani people. Because I watch all his stuff that I've seen on Netflix. He's really funny. I don't know his name, but he's on Netflix and he's funny. But he was in this. And he should have had a bigger part. He's a funny guy. They didn't give him more funny stuff. And they'll have like little uh, one-offs funny. But I really liked uh, The Rock or Black Adam and Hawkeye together. I really liked that. They would fight. And then in the end they became friendly. And then the king. It was just drama with the king. And then the guy who they thought was their friend. Turns out he was the ancestor of the king. Who was the bad guy who killed... Uh, black adam's son and they thought the statue was black adam but the statue was actually his son so he's like he's not a hero his son was the hero his son saved his life and then the king killed him and then they found the crown that's where it all starts where they find the crown and, he, and the uh black adam was locked in a tomb and they let him go and then he started killing all the bad guys but one part that was sad, oh, if you don't want to know what happens in the movie, you shouldn't watch this or listen to this video. Um, Pierce Brosnan, I did not like that they had him die. I did not like that. I would have liked to see more with him and maybe like a second movie or something. Yeah, I didn't like that he died. That, that was one of the things that I didn't like about the movie is that Pierce Brosnan died. I didn't like that. Otherwise, everything I liked about it, it was good. It was funny. Oh, and I love the end. If you stay at the end of the to the end of the credits or like midway through the credits, then you'll see like Superman, and like they fought. They thought The Rock was a bad guy. Cause they're like they had access to like these old texts that said he was a bad guy, and he basically had temper tantrums. But then they realize maybe he was the good guy. Because in the end, when they thought they won in every... Well, not in the end, but when they thought it was the end and they thought they won. Then Black Adam, he said he'd go get locked away like they wanted him to. Because he, they felt they couldn't control him and he thought it was the best. They thought it was the best thing and he agreed. So he got locked up. And then the king came back because he had to die to be alive. And then they realized that. And then that's when Pierce Brosnan dies because he tries to hold him. But then Pierce Brosnan uh, contacts Black Adam and Black Adam breaks free. And he basically sacrificed himself because he didn't want Hawkeye to die because he saw Hawkeye dying. In one of his visions, he didn't want him to die. So then he sacrificed himself. And it was like, why did you have to sacrifice yourself? It was like, you could have did everything. Saved yourself. Saved Hawkeye. Saved Black Adam. But they, all that happened. It was really good. Basically, the main thing is, if you like action, you like kick-ass fighting, you like to look at The Rock, or Dwayne Johnson, it's like, I think of him as The Rock, because I grew up watching him, and he was The Rock. Yeah, it was like, I thought he was cute then, still think he's cute. Even though he's, like, way older than me. But, 
or a fan of Dwayne Johnson. You like anything that he does. You'll like this. Um, yeah. And I liked Hawkeye, too. Hawkeye, it was like, he wanted to be a badass. He wanted to fight. Black Adam just kept kicking his ass. But it was like, he's like, I'm a badass. I'm going to fight. We're going to work together. We're going to kick his ass. And then it was like, yeah, I realize we can't kick your ass. And oh, and then I liked the little boy. He was, it was, he was sweet. And he just wants to help. And then the guy who's the descendant of the king, who they thought were their friends, and they realize he's not his friend. Then he shoots the uncle and kidnaps the boy. And it was kind of like, Black Adam thought of him kind of like his own son because his son died when he saved him. And, and that was like a sweet, sad story because he's like, he wasn't the hero. His son was the hero. And then they were like, oh, and then Henry Winkler was in the movie. I want to see more Henry Winkler if they do a second one. Like that would be good to see like Henry Winkler in it more because he was just like in like a quick little clip, uh, clip because... The young guy who's like the giant, that was his uh, nephew, I guess. Yeah, they said nephew, but I'm wondering, does they mean like great nephew or whatever? Um, but I would like to see like more Henry Winkler, like them all like get together. And they said they were a part of the Justice League. And then there was a girl who was Cyclone and she was like a genius. And then they joined in. But I could see, like, the giant guy. I don't know what his name was in the movie. But he was, like, a giant guy. But he made mistakes. But he tried. But he, but he was, like, kind of like the comic relief with the guy who was the uncle. It's like, I don't know what that guy's name is. But I watch everything that he's in. That's on Netflix. He's funny. I know he's Pakistani. I know that much. Because I just watched that show he had on Netflix. Not sure what it's called. But I just watched it. And then he had another show and I watched that show. I've seen a few things with him. I have no clue who he is. But he's funny. I know that. And I know he's Pakistani. Yeah. And yeah, it was a good movie. Yeah. And that's it for this movie review. If you like, subscribe and all that good stuff. Oh. And upcoming movies, I'm going to review soon. I will review Shazam, which is coming out soon. And Black Panther. And whatever else is coming out soon that I'll go see that interests me. So, like and subscribe. And I hope you're enjoying my movie reviews and my channel. Bye!